So here are the materials you'll be needing. You'll be needing some borax solution and this is just basically one teaspoon of borax mixed into one cup of warm water. Some clear foaming soap, a container, mixing tool, some clear glue, and lastly some bean bag filler and this is the one I use. Start off by pouring in your glue and I'm going to make a small batch. Then you want to pump in some foaming soap. If you're using cheap dollar store glue like me, then use the foaming soap because I tried it without the foaming soap and it just turned into slubber. But if you're using Elmer's glue, don't use the foaming soap. So then you could go ahead and mix and since it is the clear foaming soap, it will turn clear once you let it sit for a week. And then you could go ahead and start pouring in your borax. If you decide to use cheap glue and you don't add the foamy soap, it's going to turn into this really horrible flubber. And if you add the soap and it still turns into flubber like this, then just keep mixing in the soap until it's good. Don't do what I did, you don't have to pump up the soap, just pour in the liquid directly. It will be easier to make it more stretchy like so. So here's the slime, it's stretchy. And now you could just go ahead and add your bean bag filler. So now that all the beets are mixed in, you're basically done. You just have to store it in an airtight container and then wait a week for it to clear up. So here's how it looks after sitting for two days. And I'm just going to add a little bit more of the beets. So it doesn't exactly look like rice, but it's pretty similar. you guys enjoyed watching this video and if you did don't forget to subscribe and like and let me know what other videos you guys would like to see on my channel and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!